Do you know friends that the demand for SOC analysts is projected to increase by 18% over the next 5 years. Therefore, for those considering a career as an SOC analyst is now an opportune time to pursue it. Now before we move on and learn more about that how you can become an SOC analyst, I request you guys to watch this video till the end. But before we move on and discuss our today's agenda, I request you guys that do not forget to hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon. So guys, we are going to start our session with an introduction to who is a SOC analyst. Moving ahead, we will discuss about how to become a SOC analyst. Then we will learn about the key responsibilities of a SOC analyst. Then we will discuss the certification process for SOC analyst. And finally, we are going to conclude our session with a discussion on skill set required to become a SOC analyst. Craving a career upgrade? Subscribe, like, and comment below. Dive into the link in the description to fast track your ambitions. Whether you're making a switch or aiming higher, Simply Learn has your back. Just a quick info, guys. Simply Learn has got a postgraduate program in cybersecurity. This course is in designed in collaboration with MIT Swarjman College of Engineering and EC Council. This course is going to help you to become an expert in the rapidly growing field of cybersecurity. This program aims to help you to stay abreast of all the latest trends in the cybersecurity as well. So hurry up now and join the course. The course link is mentioned in the description box. So guys, let's start with who is a SOC analyst. So guys, SOC analyst is a cybersecurity specialist who is responsible for serving as a first line of defense against the cyber threats. These professionals focus on detecting and responding to potential security incidents to safeguard an organization's information assets. You'll be pretty surprised to know that the SOC analyst jobs will be in high demand for the next five years over an increased rate of 18%. Now let's move on and discuss about how you can become an SOC analyst. To make a career as an SOC analyst, Individuals should start by obtaining a bachelor degree in the field of computer science or related field. Additionally, pursuing training programs from reputable institutions and also obtaining relevant certifications are crucial steps in their career path. Then you should have continuous skill development, which is very essential to advance in this field. Next, the SOC analysts require not only technical expertise in security technology, but also soft skills such as proactive problem solving, and effective communication are also very important. Next thing is acquire a certification. So guys, pursuing certifications such as SOC Analyst, CSA, Certified Ethical Hacker, CompTIA Security, or GIAC Certified Intrusion Analyst is very, very beneficial for enhancing one's credentials in the cybersecurity domain. Next one is gaining the experience. Start with an entry level positions such as a security analyst or a network administrator which allows individuals to gain hands-on experience and gradually progress in their careers. Now let us discuss what are the key responsibilities of an SOC analyst. So guys, SOC analysts play a pivotal role in maintaining the security posture of an organization. Their responsibilities encompass a wide range of activities, including monitoring security systems, detecting threats, collaborating with incident response teams, and also conducting security assessments. Their key responsibilities include, the first one is monitoring. So guys, SSE analysts are tasked with ensuring the smooth functioning of a security systems to uphold business continuity. This involves continuous monitoring of firewalls, intrusion detection systems, and promptly reporting any suspicious activities. Next one is the threat detection. You have to identify and respond to a security threat that is primarily the responsibility of an SOC analyst. This involves analyzing security alerts, investigating potential incidents, and also escalating serious threats for further action. Third one is collaboration. So guys, SOC analysts collaborate with various teams within the organizations, including IT operation, incident response teams, and also compliance teams to effectively respond to security incidents and also mitigate potential risks. And finally is the security assessments. So guys, depending on your level of expertise, SOC analyst may participate in or conduct security assessments, including vulnerability scans, policy reviews, and testing the effectiveness of security controls. Now guys, let's move on and discuss what are the key certification that you can acquire to become an SOC analyst. 
सो गाइस सेवरल सर्टिफिकेशन ऑप्शंस आर अवेलेबल फॉर एसओसी एनालिस्ट टू एनहांस देयर स्किल्स एंड क्रेडेंशियल्स दीस सर्टिफिकेशंस टिपिकली इन्वॉल्व कंप्लीटिंग अ स्टडी प्रोग्राम पासिंग एन एग्जाम एंड डेमोन्स्ट्रेटिंग प्रोफिशिएंसी इन द रिलेवेंट एरियाज सो द पॉपुलर चॉइसेस आर द फर्स्ट वन इज सर्टिफाइड एसओसी एनालिस्ट और सीएसए This certification provides a comprehensive understanding of SOC operations and is suitable for individuals at both entry level and at intermediate level positions. Next one is certified ethical hacker. So guys, CEH certification equips individuals with the knowledge and skills to identify vulnerabilities in systems and conduct ethical hacking exercises to enhance cybersecurity measures. Third one is CompTIA security. So guys this certification covers the essential cyber security topics and is also recognized as a valuable credentials for professionals seeking to pursue careers in cyber security. Finally we have certified in risk and information systems control. So guys CRISC certifications focuses on IT risk management and prepares individuals to assess and mitigate risk associated with information systems. Now let's move on and discuss the very crucial part that is what are the skill set required for SOC analyst. So guys in addition to a technical expertise in SOC analysts must possess a diverse skill set to effectively fulfill their roles. These skills include the first one is the technical knowledge. If we talk about the technical knowledge guys you have to understand the operating system, networking protocols and programming languages which are very very essential for analyzing and responding to security threats effectively next one is the network defense so guys soc analysts need to have a strong grasp of network traffic analysis malware detection and firewall management to protect information assets from cyber threats the third one is ethical hacking So guys knowledge of ethical hacking techniques also enables SOC analyst to identify vulnerabilities in systems and strengthen the security measures proactively. Fourth one is the security tools. So guys you should have a proficiency in using security information and event management tools which are also known as SIEM tools. Also forensic analysis tools and networking monitoring solutions tools which are very crucial for SOC analyst to detect and respond to security incidents promptly fifth one is incident management so guys if we talk about incident management and computer forensics SOC analyst should be adapting to managing security incidents including threat detection damage mitigation initiating remediation and restoration protocols to minimize the impact of security breaches if we talk about computer forensics you should be able to analyze and collect evidence from security incidents facilitating the identification of root causes and effective incident response and finally you should have problem solving and analytical skills strong problem solving skills are very very essential for soc analyst to assess complex security threats and develop appropriate strategies to address them in real time So guys in conclusion becoming an SOC analyst requires the combination of educations certifications degree skill development and practical experience by following the outlined steps and acquiring the necessary skills and credentials individuals can pursue a rewarding career in the cyber security domain as a SOC analyst so guys that was all for today's video i hope so you would have enjoyed our today's video on how to become an SOC analyst Hi there. If you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.